Hi, I'm Hyun Kuk Lee from APL. I'm pleased to introduce DuoPen, our new psychoacoustic panel for stereo image shaping and correction. In this video, I'll walk you through DuoPen's main features and show you how it sounds in action. DuoPen is based on our research into the psychoacoustics of stereo and binaural localization. It enables you to add width and depth to mono tracks in ways that go far beyond conventional pan pods. And it can also be used to correct or reshape the spatial balance of stereo tracks while keeping their natural width intact. Conventional pan pots rely only on the amplitude difference between the left and right channels. But over headphones, this often sounds unnatural, especially with hard pan sounds that feel stuck inside the ear canal. Since most people listen to music on headphones today, Making your mix sound natural on headphones is more important than ever. Duopan is designed exactly for that. It uses a combination of time and amplitude cues based on my psychoacoustic model, giving you a more natural, binaural-like stereo image over headphones, while also providing a more spacious image over speakers. Here's how conventional pample sounds. and with your pen. In DuoPan, T refers to the time difference and A refers to the amplitude difference. The time-amplitude ratio allows you to flexibly control the spatial character of the stereo image. More time gives you a wider and deeper sound, and more amplitude makes it sharper and more focused sound. If you are familiar with stereo mic techniques, this is like moving between a spaced AB pair, a coincident XY, or near-coincident setup like OLTF. The dual band mode opens up new creative possibilities. You can apply different pan positions and time amplitude ratios to low and high frequencies separately with an adjustable crossover point. This means you can give the low end one kind of spread and the highs another, so you can sculpt the stereo image with much more precision.
The shadow control simulates the natural head shadow effect. In natural hearing, the high frequency energy is reduced at the ear farther from the sound source because the head acts as a barrier and the brain uses this information for localization. On the other hand, low frequencies are localized mainly through the time difference rather than the amplitude difference. By combining the shadow feature with the dual band panning, dual pan can mimic how we actually hear sounds in space, making the stereo image feel like it's wrapping around your head instead of sitting inside it. Duopan isn't just for mono tracks, it's great for stereo sources too. With conventional panning, stereo tracks often lose their spaciousness when you pan them off center like this. With Duopan, you can preserve the spaciousness while moving the focal point of the image. By adjusting the time and amplitude ratio, you can decide exactly how much spread you want. Now, with dual band engaged, you can even fine-tune the spectral and spatial balance of the stereo recording. For example, you might control the low end of a string section separately from the higher frequencies, giving you detailed control of the stereo image. Duopan is also a powerful tool for fixing balance issues in stereo recordings. For example, with drum overheads recorded using a spaced mic pair, 
The snail or kick can often end up off to one side. Using a conventional pan pot to fix this imbalance issue in mixing causes the stereo image to become narrow and unnatural, as in this example. But with the open, you can bring the snare or kick to the center while keeping the cymbals and hi-hat in their original positions. Last but not least, you can use DuoPan for your immersive audio production too. When you insert DuoPan on a mono or stereo track on Pro Tools, you will see the options to choose the output format, and DuoPan will recognize the available output channels. Then you can route your panned signals to any pair of speakers. Other DAWs that support multi-channel audio will also support this feature. In this video, I will use the APL Virtuoso Binauralizer to demonstrate this feature over virtual loudspeakers in the virtual APL listening room. With the traditional panning, panning in between speakers especially in a lateral segment like between front left and side left can often cause coloration and localization blur. But with dual pan, you can achieve more accurate and natural sounding result. Here's a quick comparison. <laughs> 